And learning could soon grind to a halt in the northeastern region due to an exodus of non-local teachers. Teachers in their numbers have been camping outside the Teachers Service Commission, TSC, in Garissa, seeking transfers from the region after a series of attacks that has seen several teachers brutally killed. Meanwhile, teachers' unions are calling on the government to find a lasting solution to the crisis that now threatens the stability of education across northeastern counties. Let's get more from our very own Makori Ongechi. They flocked the Teacher Service Commission offices in Garissa town. Non-local teachers ready to exit the region following rampant cases of terror attacks. The latest only two days ago where three teachers were killed in a suspected Al-Shabaab attack in Kamude area. Drawn from Fafi, Ijara, Hulugo and Dadab, the tutors demanded that their employer transfers them from what they now see as a dangerous place. Our CEO, Madam Nas Masharia, kindly look into the issue of a teacher who is working five kilometers to the border. Kindly look into the issue of a teacher who is on the target. But the commission wants the teachers to exercise patience. Garissa TSC Regional Director Rafael Taruz, who spoke to Citizen TV on phone, said a high-level meeting bringing together county and national government officials had been planned to address the matter. He urged the teachers to remain calm and to carry on teaching as the commission addresses their transfer demands. Teachers unions up in arms against TSC directive. The Kenya Union of Post-Primary Education Teachers has expressed concern that the government has shown little effort in protecting the teachers despite a series of attacks that have seen several teachers lose their lives in recent years. Notice the Teachers Service Commission wants them to go there immediately and that will not work well for the teachers who are feeling very, very traumatized. We have also asked the commission and the government to actually go and investigate what could be the role of the local community because the school that was attacked was very far away from Somali border. Most of the affected teachers were contracted by the commission and are required to work in the area between three to five years before seeking transfer. The Monday attack coming barely a week after militants killed four pupils from Sareto Primary School in Garissa and left three others injured. A similar attack on teachers in the region two years ago saw two tutors lose their lives, leading to a mass exodus of teachers from the northeastern region. In early 2016, TSC conducted a recruitment drive that was largely aimed at addressing a teacher shortage that had been occasioned by similar attacks on non-locals in the region Wajia, Mandera and Garissa. Makori Citizen TV, Nairobi.